Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you how to create this colorful gradient with pink shatter. This is so easy and it's perfect for summer can, since you can use neons. So I absolutely love it, so hopefully you will too. So if you're interested, just keep on watching. So first apply a base coat and then paint your nails one coat of white. This will just help the colors that we're about to put on stand out brighter. Okay, so now take some scissors and a foundation sponge and cut off the bottom and this is what we'll use to create the gradient. So just cut it off. So now using the flat part of the foundation sponge, I'm gonna be um, using four colors. The first one is a glittery neon turquoise and I'm just going to be putting it on there and then I'm gonna be using orange and you can use yellow instead I'm just using orange and then you're going to be using a neon lime green and then an indigo purple color and because this is a sponge it will get soaked up so I'm going to be applying a second coat to all of them to make sure that they're still there and not all soaked up and just go ahead and put it all there and um, if you have shorter nails then you can only then you should only use about three colors but I'm just going to be using four. Then, after that's done, dab it onto a piece of paper once or twice and then start dabbing it onto your nail to create the colorful gradient. And don't worry about any polish getting onto your skin since we'll remove that in a minute. So just keep dabbing it until it's very opaque. Okay, and now we're gonna take a Q-tip dipped into the polish mover and we're just gonna clean up around our nails so that way we don't look all colorful and just clean up all around wherever the nail polish has gotten on your fingers, just clean up. And try to get it as clean as possible, just like this. And then we can move on to the next step. So now take some pink shatter and apply a thick or thin coat depending on how you want it to look. And I forgot to mention, you're not going to be using any pinks on the gradient because we are going to be using pink shatter. So that way the colors underneath stand out better. And wait for it to crackle and finally apply a top coat to protect your design from chipping away and also to provide a shine to the crackle since it's kind of matte. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, or rate. If you have a request or any questions for me, just leave them in the comments. Follow me on Instagram and Keek. Username is 13 Girl. And have a fun summer, and I'll see you next time. Bye!